plunges there and I'm like, can I jump off that? And he's like, do you want to jump off it? And I'm like, I kind of have to. Some, someone's going to jump off it. Yeah. Like, like, Rewind, recap, relive for over 50 episodes. The Revolutionary Force in Wrestling Interview. To go off of that for you, Shane, big match, I'm sure you get asked about a lot, was the uh, the second Dusty Classic versus AOP. Yeah. How was that experience for you? And, of course, the spot jumping off of the, uh, the Shark Tank theme. Got asked about that. What were you thinking during that? Uh, I was not thinking too much. <laughs> no, that was... Uh, <laughs> That was a that was a long process of all of that. Like uh, like a lot of like during a lot of it, we we're getting told by some people like, "Yeah, you're winning the Dusty Classic, you're winning it," and I'm like, "No, we're not." Like I knew we won. Like look at the way you're pushing AOP, and like you're not. We're not winning. Like that's not a thing. I had a torn ACL at that point as well. So um, when you leaped, when you leaped off the uh, the short yeah. Cage. Yeah, wow. the, like weeks before that is the speaking of Roderick Strong, my singles match in the tag tournament against him. That's when I tore my ACL, um, and then but like I'd, I'd done it before, and I like the first time I did it, I just wrestled. I kept wrestling for six more months, and like the muscles around your leg kind of take over. When I tore it, I I think I took like a week off, and we just taped the shit out of it, and. It was fine. Like it's not. It's not going to get any worse. Mm-hmm. Um, and my bone, my knee, and my leg muscles knew how to stabilize it anyway. Um, so yeah, we like we we're told we we're going to be main event of the show. Um, we'd have twenty plus minutes, and we were winning. And then on the day, we got moved to open up. Lost like ten minutes, and they're like they're up. And I'm like, yeah, I know. Like, yeah, yeah, okay, cool. Like, whatever. But we're walking around there, setting that thing up. And I'm looking at it. And I'm like, well, we've got a gimmick match. We've got to use the fucking gimmick somehow. <laughs> um, and like, punch is there. And I'm like, can I jump off that? And he's like, do you want to jump off it? And I'm like, I kind of have to. Some Someone's got to jump off it. Yeah. Like, like, you can't have it and not jump off it. I so, love that. Yeah. yeah we, we were like, we've been like working with AOP a lot on the mm-hmm. coconut loops and stuff like that. And they're good brothers, um, good guys, good people. So yeah, that, and then the next year's Dusty Classic where we were, we had them in the opening round as the rematch and they were up, they were like, get everything, hit everything on us. And um, I hit the big one with the Falcon Arrow and I swear to God, and I got in trouble for that. They were like, you're not allowed to lift him up. I was like, who are you to lift him up? And I was like, and I, I swear in the original they cut it out. But <laughs> I, I, I went back and watched it. It's, it, it's still in there. Um, and, yeah, we were just like, let's go out there and just, like, kill me. And so that's what I was like. Have, you ever, like, have you ever seen someone get powerbombed onto the apron from inside the ring? And they're like, no, I'm like, let's try that. Let's just go do it. <laughs> like, yeah. They're like, are you sure, Shane? Like, he's, Shane, he's crazy, man. You sure? And I'm like, worst case, you miss, I hit the ground, and I get some time off. <laughs> I was like, like, the last thing that that worst thing that happens is I get some time off. <laughs> I mean, I yeah. guess I could have died. Oh, uh, yeah, but, no, I mean, you're already at the ACL. <laughs> <and> that, <laughs> that's not my problem either. Rewind, recap, relive for over 50 episodes, the revolutionary force in wrestling interviews.